Hello guys, Survival Scout here and today we're going to analyze the survival story of Eric Lemarque. Eric Lemarque went, went for snowboarding one beautiful day in the Sierra Nevada mountains in March 2003. He had no idea that by the end of the night he would be lost and moving further from safety every single minute. The former Olympic hockey player veered off cross along the 11,000 feet Mammoth Mountain. Because Le Marquet obviously had no aware of what would happen, he didn't have many supplies. He did however have his mp3 player with him. Replaying a scene from a, from a movie, Le Marquet used the radio signal from his mp3 to use it as a compass. During his adventure he extremed extremely cold temperatures and after falling into rusting water almost fell down on 80 foot waterfall. Le Marquet's 7 day ordeal left him malnourished, exhausted and with several frostbites with damage to his lower extremities. Both his feet and parts of his legs had to be amputated. But no matter what he faced, he actually managed to survive that badass challenge. Clearly, Eric hadn't had that good times back then, but all this situation has its hidden sides that mainly caused this rough adventure. Firstly, he decided to go for a small trip in order to do an extreme sport without letting anyone know. But even we can say that if he even had told someone about where he was going, the rescue team would seek for a drop in the ocean, because in every step he made, he was getting further and further from his start point and the, po and the area that rescue team would uh, look for him. Also, he made the mistake to be unprepared. Fairly Scout's quote is, be prepared. Eric thought that he would, that he would be just fine if he didn't have any supplies, because that would be just a small walk, right? No. Well, you should be prepared and bring the right equipment due to the thought that anything could happen. I think that he might have thought that because he's an Olympic hockey player, which means that he is one of the best in the world when it comes to snow and ice, she could withstand various things. No. Wrong. This is not correct. Because you are uh, expert in something, it doesn't mean that you don't have the danger to get injured or something like that. Anything could go wrong. What you should do is that you must always be prepared for anything you can think of. But as much as you study about survival, it's and one of that situations that could happen to you is unique and can be varied in many different ways. So actually you cannot predict what will happen. So guys, that was the survival story of Eric Lemarque. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, like and share it. Subscribe for more weekly survival videos. And see you next Thursday with a brand new video.